giving a, sh a good show to the public is not necessarily what is going to keep you, um, what is going to allow you to win Big Brother. Alex said, I don't think the format is a problem. It's all because of, the, of comps, bad casting, and stupid twists. Well, what else do you have if it's not the comp, the casting, and the tweet? Like, I mean, I, I get, I, I understand what you're, I understand what you're saying, the the fact that the players. But the thing is that there is a blueprint in Big Brother that is working. We have seen year after year that the alliances work, and there's a dichotomy I would say with Big Brother. There's the you are a house guest in the house, so you are here to entertain the public, right, on one hand. But on the other hand, you are here to win. And giving a, sh a good show to the public is not necessarily what is going to keep you, um, what is going to allow you to win Big Brother, right? Big flashy moves sometimes put a target on your back, and that's the problem. The current format of Big Brother is such that the players in the house have a goal to win, so they will tend to make rational decisions, you know, not rocking the boat, not going against the house, having a major alliance, da da da, all of that. Um, so that's the problem. Um, yeah, and BB is like a sport. I mean, hockey is the same game as it was 100 years ago, and it's still nice. You're telling that to the wrong person because I don't like hockey. I, I'm going to say it. I don't like hockey. I don't like hockey. I watched basketball. I watched hockey. And basketball is more fun. The thing is, it's different. Because you watch hockey to know who is going to win in the end. right? Because you're competitive. Because you have an attachment to your hometown. And you want to see your hometown win. It's a competitive side of you. But Big Brother, do we really watch it because we want the player to win? Or do we watch it because we want entertainment? And I think for the most of us, we would rather have entertainment than... We're not here to watch the journey of one house guest. Whereas when we watch sports, we are here to see the journey of our own team. And that's what makes it different. Cocky doesn't have to change the format because the, literally the end game is different. Whereas Big Brother... You need to find a way to make it more entertaining to us. But I do agree that the major, 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 I 1,000% agree that the major problem is the casting and even the comps. That's 1,000% and the twist. The twist, the twists are not dilemmas. The twists are just additional games. They're not dilemmas. You need to make them into dilemmas. Josh says, I don't, I don't know what it is, but I don't like Whitney's smile. That sounds messed up. You don't like you don't like Whitney's smile. I actually think she has very... I think she has lip injections. Maybe that's what you don't like. Or maybe... Does she have lip injections? I think it's the lip injections. Whitney BB23. Let's look at her. Because I think she's very beautiful, actually. I think it's the lip injections, the problem. Yeah, it's the lip injections. I'm looking at it, and I'm just like... She's very pretty, but I think she'd be prettier if she had natural lips. Or is it? Now I'm so confused. I'm so used to seeing people with lip injections that now when I see people's lips, I don't even know if they're real or if they're fake. If it's her real lips, I'm very, very sorry. I'm so... No, I think they're fake. I think it's, those are fake lips. I don't think those are her real lips. I'm, I'm looking at it. So let's uh, let's pull up... Uh, let's pull up uh, Brit Whitney's image. Let's pull up Whitney. Because she's actually, and you know what the thing, what's unfortunate with um, fake lips is that it gives people bigger smile lines. That's the problem. But I think she's very pretty. But it's just, yeah, it's just the, the, um, the injections. Whitney could go, I don't particularly care about Whitney. She doesn't bother me. I don't hate her. I don't, I just don't care about her. But she seems really nice. She doesn't seem bad at all. Uh, no, BB, we don't like showmances, bro. I freaking love showmances, man. I I don't like that when there's a showmance, the whole house is against them because it gets boring because it gets so predictable. But I like a cute story, like Dimitri and Aika when they were like, you know, flirty and da da da. A good showman. Some showmance I hate, like um, Tyler and what's her name, Angela. I did not like them. I did not like Tyler and Angela. But um, yeah, exactly. So it depends on the showmance, but. Yeah, but who I ship, I really ship Hannah and Derek X. I like Hannah, but I don't really... Oh, I like Hannah, 
but I don't really like her her smile either. It sounds wrong. <laughs> I sound wrong for that. Yeah, you wrong for that. You wrong for that. You wrong for that. I know, right? Sasu said Josh is ruthless. Yo, he don't like no one's smile. I'm like, I'm not. Not. Now I'm going to do the live stream like this. Because I don't want you to observe my smile. <laughs> I don't want you to be like, yo, I don't like her smile. Nah, but it's cool, fam. To each its own, you know? To each its Hell no, I hate showmances from viewer's perspective and game perspective. What? I like when there's a nice showmance. When the, the story is cute, you know? There's like, um... There's... You see their development. I'm trying to think of a showmance that I liked. I can't, act, I can't actually think of a showman that I like, to be honest. Is there a showman? Except Dimitri and Aika. Is there a showman that I like? I don't think there's any showman that I've liked. I say this. I say that I like showmances, but I don't remember any that I like. Unpopular opinion. Brooke and Sheldon annoyed the f*** out of me. And you know which showmans I liked? Yes. Let me tell you my kind of showmans. Jamar and Min, Min Lee. I like that showman. I know... There was, like, tension between the two because I think Min Lee is a bit explosive, has a bit of an explosive personality. But when I was watching it, I was literally going on YouTube to see clips of them together because I loved their dynamic. You see, that's the kind of showmance I like. So I like people who are in that I want you, I don't want you kind of relationship, you know? Um, Alex said um, they shouldn't announce the final votes by a vote of 6 to 3. No, 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 please stop it. Um, make the house guests want to make big moves thousand percent that way you don't that's a very good option uh, i sorry that's a very good uh observation that would be really good because you wouldn't need to vote with the house if you did that yo contact cbs and literally write to them and tell them that because that would be so awesome literally thousand yo you should be a producer on big brother because that's a such a good idea such a such a good idea sasu said or oh, maybe they would they should do a season with a whole cast that has never watched the show <sighs> but the problem we, we saw it with big brother celebrity that when you put people who don't know what big brother is about they want to leave they don't want to stay right they don't have that grit to stay in the house so it's very tricky it's very tricky uh, I had I had not thought about it that way because when you put players that know how to play, they're very predictable. But the thing is, when you have players who don't know what Big Brother is, they are floaters in the game. So that's the problem. Sasu said, oh, I get that, uh, what Josh means now. Oh, when I showed the picture of uh, of Whitney. I mean, I mean, and who else he didn't like? Hannah? Hannah? I ain't gonna judge people's appearances. I mean, I just did. I did. I did it the whole episode. I'm like, I'm such a hypocrite. I'm such a hypocrite. 